What's up, Trevor? I just wanted to make this uh, second video response to uh, your question that you had in, in the first response I made about Matthew 3 and 14 and John 1 and 32, which seems to be a, a contradiction. In Matthew 3 and 14, uh, John the Baptist is saying, uh, telling Jesus that he needed to be uh, baptized by him recognizing Jesus as a Messiah and then uh, in John and John 1 and 32 John says uh, I knew him not unless the Holy Spirit descended upon him well it seems like in a contradiction but it's actually not because if you think about the the, the historical context at that time uh, Jesus believers who walked with him and knew him as a Messiah uh, we're looking at him as the Messiah who was coming to be their earthly king who was coming to uh, Deliver them from the Roman Empire at that time And so they recognized him as the Messiah, but they didn't have the full revelation of who the Messiah was actually being God uh, And we can see this uh, We can see this in uh, in many scriptures uh, if you go to John 18 and 36 this is Jesus talking to Pontius Pilate and Jesus answered and said my kingdom is not of this world if my kingdom were of this world my servants would fight so that I should not be delivered to the Jews but now my kingdom is not from here and so he either had to let Pontius Pilate know that my kingdom is not of this world and <clears throat> either farther down the uh, Jews tried to use that Pontus, against Pontius Pilate and say uh, anybody who claimed to be a king is not a friend of Caesar's and they tried to use that against Pontius Pilate to get him to crucify Jesus also in the book of John in chapter 4 verse 24 Jesus was talking to the woman at the well the Samaritan woman and he had to clarify clarify to her who he was because you know she said the Jews worship say we must worship in Jerusalem and the Samaritans worship on this mountain but Jesus told her that the time comes and even is now that where men must worship the Father in spirit and in truth letting them know it don't matter where you worship you worship God in your heart because God is a spirit he uh, must be worshiped in spirit and truth also if we turn to John 19 and 12 Oh, that's uh, dealing with Caesar. If we go to, uh, I'm sorry, Luke 19:41-42, we we'll also see another example of how the the Jews were looking for an earthly king. Uh, John, I'm sorry, Luke 19:41-42, uh, and it reads. Now as he drew near, he saw the city and wept over it, saying, If you had known, even you, especially in this your day, the things which make for your peace, but now they are hidden from your eyes. See, Jesus wept over Jerusalem because they didn't know the time of their visitation. They didn't know that God was with them in their presence, in their midst. So he wept over them because he knew of the, the coming destruction. Now, John the Baptist says, I knew him in Matthew 3 and 14. He knew him as Messiah. He had a partial revelation of who he was. And then after he baptized Jesus in John 1 and 32, he knew that he was God then. That's what he said. That's why he said, I, I didn't know him. I did not know who he was until I saw this. The Spirit of God, the Holy Spirit, descended on him like a dove, and then his eyes were open. The same thing happened with uh, with uh, Thomas and John and John twenty and twenty eight. You know, Thomas walked with Jesus and he accepted Jesus as the Messiah, but he's the one. He said, "Unless I see the handprints and the holes in his hands and." stick my hand in his side from the spirit wound then I'm not going to believe so Jesus told him in 20 and 28 
And Thomas answered and said unto him, My Lord and my God. He saw the resurrected Christ and he recognized him as God. So it's no contradiction between Matthew 3 and 14 and John and 1 and 32. It's just that they didn't, uh, the, John the Baptist didn't have a full comprehension of who Jesus was. He knew him as the Christ, he knew him as the Messiah. But until he baptized him, he didn't know him as God. And so when he baptized him, he, uh, you know, knew him as God. He just didn't have a full revelation. I hope that answered your question. I hope I was clear on that. All right. Thank you. Have a good day.